Well, that was actually pretty easy. Usually, the computer players are way worse at that. They actually weren't this time! That's right, we won. Take it in. Why'd you block my face with your freaking shoulder, DK? Finally! No matter what number I get, I get a star. And then I get to screw Yoshi over because I'm gonna land on a happening space after this. Look at that. First place. Sweetness. Sorry, Yoshi. I know you're my bud, but I didn't really have a choice this time. Whatever, at least I am now tied with Luigi and Donkey Kong for the, um, happening star. Here's another factor about the sandy part of the island. Um, if you pass Koopa ten times, I believe, he'll give you twenty coins instead of ten. Um, regardless of its of if it's the last five turns or not. So that's always good too if you stay over here and you just happen to be the lucky one. Which the way things are going now, I probably will be, you know, the ninth player around. Instead of the tenth. Oh Yoshi, if only you could have you know, if only you could go back in time and get towed. But whatever. You're in fourth. You can deal with it. So I'm surprised I haven't brought this up yet, but Yoshi's Tropical Island was actually the first Mario Party board I ever played. I rented this game with my sisters from Blockbuster when it first came out. It's probably this same month, February of 99. And we all just, um, we saw the commercial on TV and we were like, oh, that looks cool. Let's get that game or let's try it. And so we rented it and I absolutely loved it. But we played a 35 turn game of Yoshi's Tropical Island and we all sucked so horribly, it was not even funny. And we didn't start out with the one computer player we had um, on easy either, which we probably should have. We started them out just normal. And we didn't know how to play any of the mini games, so um, we were all like complaining the whole time. We got, we seriously probably got seven chance times also. And every time we got near the star, someone landed on a happening space and we screwed each other over. and. Yep, I was I was Wario. One of my sisters was Peach. The other was Yoshi. And then we had Mario as our computer player and we were like this game is cheating. It's giving Mario everything. We suck and I still like the game but we were all complaining and um at the end of the game it ended up where like I don't know. It was some really random number of stars that everyone had and then I just happened to get the happening space star and I won so I won the very first time I ever played Mario Party and you know that's another reason I stick with Wario he's my winner first time I won wasn't the last crap I not I'm talking and I'm not thinking you guys, that sucked. I'm sorry. I was not concentrating. Oh well. Um. So I have pretty good memories. Pretty frustrating memories with this board too, from the very first time I played this game. But they were memories of me winning the very first time, so I was happy. And, as I pointed out once before, the first minigame I ever played was Slot Car Derby. Terrible. 
Second mini game ever was Tipsy Tourney. I don't remember what third was. I'm not gonna try. I just remember those two being the first. Star. My sisters and I also loved Facelift and Crazy Cutter the first time we played this, and those are still like, well, obviously Facelift is still my favorite mini game, but I like Crazy Cutter too. I just got worse at it over the years somehow, and. Yeah, we pretty much have the same thoughts on this game as we did back then. Love for Mario Party. It's all good. Okay, so... Donkey Kong is going to get another star, which I am not happy about. But whatever. No one cares, DK. No one cares. Oh man, we already played this! Alright, I gotta get my hand ready. That was another thing. I remember the first time we, um, my sisters and I played this, we were like, what are we supposed to do when it said to rotate the control stick because no other N64 game we had played or ever played after that, or, as I've explained once before, since Mario Party is the only one that uses the re rotate the control stick function. Um, but when we saw that in the instructions, we were like, what? What are we supposed to do? And then, you know, I think by the end of the game, all three of us, our hands were completely bruised because we got so many rotate the control stick mini games. You know, th those are in the the good old days or good old years, I should say, of when I had a callus on my hand from rotating the control stick so much. It was pretty intense. Yep, I'm staying on the sandy part. I'm just not gonna venture out. What? Four ones and a two? I should have five ones because I should be in first, but instead DK is. Suck it, DK. No one likes you. So this board's going pretty smoothly, I have to say. I feel a little safer saying that since it's, you know, over halfway over, but... Crane game? Again? He's gonna go for me. I'm Alright, I'm gonna have to work this A button now, or I am going to be in deep, deep jazz. Okay. Oh god, I've got to go to- come on! Oh, thank god. Miss. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that sweet skill. You missed. And it was the worst thing in the world. I just love the music. The miss music. I wish every time I missed in life, the miss music would come on. Just to brighten my day. Yoshi, why do you do this? You're gonna land on a happening space. Whatever, at least I'm not, like, right next to the star. If you watch closely, you'll notice that Bowser just kind of, like... He doesn't even fade in from the background. He just, like, pops in this random area and floats in on a shell. It doesn't make any sense. Like, how'd he just appear out of nowhere? I don't know. Even for as skinny as Luigi is, he gets to suck at fitting in the inner tube. Alright, Luigi, that was a little bit overdramatic. As far as storylines go for the individual boards on this game, I would say that this board has the cutest storyline. It's the... Uh, Blue Yoshi and the pink Yoshi have been separated by whirlpools on the island, and 
they can't get back to one another. And they're sad about it. And when you become the superstar, you make a path for them to be together again. So everybody should just go, aww, when this game ends. Because it's so cute. Wow. Speaking of Yoshi, he's hit rock bottom with this one. Oh my god, we played this game already on this board, too. Whatever. At least I win this game all the time. Sorry if you heard that, that is my cat crying right now. I had no idea she was in my room. She actually is and she wants out, but I cannot get up at the moment.